good morning to one and all now i would like to explain a small topic on matrices first of all what is meant by matrix this is nothing but a set of numbers a set of numbers arranged in the form of rectangular array having rows and columns let us see an example here a is the matrix okay so this is a matrix here a is a represent matrix name and here 1 2 5 2 0 5 6 7 8 these are all numbers this elements or this numbers are called elements these numbers are called elements so here this is the square bracket matrices are used in square brackets or a parenthesis brackets or a double bar these brackets are used indicate matrix symbols okay here we have to count top to bottom or rows that means this is row 1 and this is row 2 and this is row 3 and the next we have to count left to right these are columns that means this is c1 means column 1 column 2 and the column 3 so very very important is matrix means order so order is nothing but a type or a size so order order means the number of rows into the number of columns okay so we see an above example here three rows and three columns so we have to write 3 into 3 but we have to tell 3 by 3 matrices okay so and the next these matrices are different types types of matrices types of matrices then first type first one is rectangular matrices okay rectangular matrices means the number of rows is not equal to the number of columns for example if a is the matrix of this one so here this one is row 1 
and this one is row 2 and this one is row 3. This is column 1 and this is column 2. So, this order is 3 into 2. Okay. A is the matrix of order 3 by 2. And the next second one is Square matrices. Square matrix mean the number of rows is equal to the number of columns. Okay. And see one example. Here A is a matrices. This is the matrix of order three by three. Okay. Column matrix. A matrix having only one column is called column. Here A is the matrix. This is the matrix. The three rows and one column. Okay. Next one. Null matrix. Null matrix means this is an zero matrix. Null matrix is also called zero matrix. If all the elements of matrix are zeros is called null matrix. Okay, we have to see an example. Here we have to take out Null matrix is capital O. This is the null matrix. We have to write order this here. Here two rows and three columns. Okay. Three columns. This is the null matrix of order 2 by 3. Next one. Next one. Diagonal matrix. If all the elements. If all the elements of a square matrix are zeros except those of principal diagonals then the matrix is called diagonal matrix let us see one example here A is a matrix This is the diagonal matrix. Observe this one. These principal diagonals are elements and other all elements are zeros. This is a square matrix. Okay. 
next one principal diagonal elements this is not a definition but we have to go to definition of diagonal matrix first for we have to write diagonal elements what are the diagonal elements so we have to take a square matrix all those elements a i j here a is i j this is the element of i throw j element for i is equal to j are called principal diagonal elements of a square matrix we have to take an example this is the square matrix of order 3 here we have to observe these elements i is equal to z means row element and column element are equal so here a11 and a22 and a33 these elements are called principal diagonal elements okay next one scalar matrix scalar matrix means a matrix in which the diagonal elements of all equal and all the other elements of zeros is called scalar matrix let us see one example here a is a matrix this is the 4 by 4 square matrix observe this one all the diagonal elements are equal and other elements are zero this is called a scalar matrix next one identity matrix or a unit matrix if all the diagonal elements are if all the diagonal elements are unity and all other elements of zeros is called a unit matrix or a identity matrix it is denoted by i n here n is the order of the matrix okay let us see one example here i2 here 2 means 2 by 2 matrix so is equal to 1 0 0 1 this is the unit matrix of order 2 and another example i3 3 means 3 by 3 square matrix 1 0 0 0 1 0 Zero zero one. This is the unit matrix of order three. Okay.